Let's see what we've got in here then, shall we? Oh, there we go. This thing's so boring. But we in here might make things interesting. In fact, you've got a great idea. Why don't you have a little Q&A? Every time someone gets a question wrong, you have to take an article of clothing off. Seriously? I'm, I'm, I'm not up to rest not, not in a million years. Okay. Guess we won't be studying at all then. That's not what I meant. As long as everyone keeps their clothes on, I'm fine with helping you to study. Probably help me too. So what you're saying is their clothes might be on the exam. Got it. What's the point of studying? I just want to go to a fencing club, damn it. Man, you always like this when it comes to exam sessions. Can't really say I disagree, bro. As soon as we're all done with exams, let's see if we can get back to the club. You got anything for me, mate? Always try to ensure my cafeteria's menu stays healthy and well-balanced. Chef Ramsay. Look, you girls keep chasing me off since I don't want to be bothered when studying. You got anything new for me? Oh, do you used to want a sandwich? So, no, we don't. I don't actually have any money, sorry, mate. But, I could buy the Imperial Chronicle. Uh, events. I'll go up to the upper floor, see what it's like up here. We're about to begin a study session for the upper class students from a salon. Only the finest minds have been invited. Naturally, it includes a number of second years as well. It's hard to imagine a better group to study with. Had you accepted my offer, Schwarzer? You would have been able to join us. I suppose there's a little point in telling you about it now. Stuck up trick. I didn't comment about those midterms, Darby. I never have a problem with classic studies or literature. In fact, I'm very excited over classical studies. Mm. Chess club. We had a match against the upper class in chess club. Just before the exam started. And you know what? We won. Rikaius was every bit as good as I expected him to be. Good for you, Rikaius. Oh, you were here as well. I didn't notice you were here. Doesn't appear to be anything else in the um, room here. Instead, I will now leave here and go to the next area. Get both through here. Oh, now I've just got the um, main building to do. Our midterms are really closing in. But I'm more afraid of exam period being over. When the exams is over, I can start going to swimming practice again. Never mind, just ignore me. 
I should probably be making my way home soon too. This will be your very first midterm, won't they? I should admit I'm a little nervous too. First time I've come with questions. It'll be fine as long as you study on upon it. Don't be afraid to ask questions. Yeah, I'll ask. There are a couple of art history things I need to clearing up actually. Oh my, students are relying on me. What a pleasant surprise. Art evolved in very complex ways during the Middle Ages, you see. That was the first examination period for you first years. Don't let it get to you. You're probably nervous already, but the faculty land is off the limits. You want to see a teacher? You can knock on the door and ask. You got something you want to ask me? Sure, why not? I think I got a normal size question. Figures. So maybe you got stumped. I'll get you up to speed. Okay, Principal, what you got? I see. Keep do you all at turbid terms. Gotcha, makes sense, I suppose. And this is the conference room which we can't go into. It strains credulity to imagine everyone forget an umbrella. May I escort you home, Mademoiselle? We stroll along safely tucked under the same umbrella as a raindrop form of emotional percussive concert. Maybe I'm lost in the balance, let's go to the second floor. That class, nobody in here. I'm so absorbed in studying. I don't think anyone will call my grades amazing. Oh, well, there's actually someone on the roof. I love a rain. Let me let, let you in on a little secret. I do need to study thanks to a special little trick of mine. Page 44 will be our oval science exam. It's certain, this is fate. That's a fortune teller I was looking to see. Studying? For exams? I <laughs> sure you jest. Excellent grades come naturally to me. There's no need for something as common as studying. Mm. This is all kinds of adorable. Refuses to admit she's been studying. And things like this which make me smile. The nobles and the commoners working together. You might have noticed, but I'm almost science whiz. My dad's arrived for the employee. I gotta say, he always used to help me study. Gotta, gotta say. We're feeling pretty good. Can't wait to get a perfect score. You see? Nah, sorry, I can't teach to save my life. The music room is actually a great place to study during a test period. It's so quiet. I invited Alan to go study with me, but he turned me down. Maybe he's really trying to avoid me. Alan? Are you sure you don't want to study with Bridget? I mean, she definitely went out of her way to ask you. I don't need her help. Let's hope we can get back to a dorm. We sweets are delicious, Nicholas. It's always helpful to eat something sweet. Don't eat too many, though. I say only any needs to study. It should be easy enough. Do you believe that is lots of the door for the almost computer room to be open? Nope. Let's have a look to see who we're going to visit though. We can study that pair. 
Do that pair. Definitely do need to speak to that pair because of this one. This is class prayers and the absolutely adorable feline girl. I tell you, going over Everbonian history. I can remember, I can't memorise things like this. It's all pointless. V, that seems a little harsh. Oh, I know. Why don't you join us, Ween? I'm sure it would make studying more enjoyable for V too. Yeah, why not? The exam's going to be focused on the War of the Lions, right? That's right. Should we start from the beginning? After that, Drycor's gathered soldiers of the Nord Highlands. And the year 952, reception cannon day, liberated the capital, bringing an end to the war. Excellent. Well done, Fee. I guess it's stuck. Certainly, the war came to an end in July that year, which is next month, so it's easy to remember. They say it was raining in Heimdall that month that day. Legend has it, the moment Emperor Drykor stopped into the city, the rain stopped. Oh, that's neat. Yeah, it seems like a story that'll stick in my memory. You're a pretty good teacher, aren't you? Well, I'm always used to tricks like these to help me remember. Having fun while I study makes it much easier for materials to stick. If you can do it, then we can do it too. Should we finish up our stuff then? Okay. Are you actually studying here? Oh, hi, Ween. I guess you're studying. I suppose it's probably fine, but it's going to be my first midterms. Doesn't help military ac academics have a lot of subjects. Combat studies, military science. And you're going to want to make sure you're ready for political e economics exam too. Which was stash man subject. That's not a very nice thing to call Vice Principal Heinrich. He does seem like type to write a ridiculously hard exam. Oh, I know, but I can't give me a hand on studying for it. If you're free at least. Of course, you're always help helping me out, right? Please tell me economics is terribly strong subject. You wouldn't want to pass this up. That's an interesting thing. Do I study with them um, or do I go for bond? You don't actually get much one from this. So I will. Well, if you're offering up, I'd really appreciate it. Sure am. Let's get started. Most of the stuff I was unsure about makes a lot more sense now. That's good to hear. We should probably go over some current affairs too. For exam. Yeah. Vice Principal has a habit of putting questions based on recent news. This year, maybe we should go over some recently enacted laws. That sounds like kind of thing you put in there. Just so most people can be caught off guard. Get it wrong, get lectured for being indifferent about society. I'd rather avoid that. Recent laws, recent laws, recent laws. Oh, the Financial Transactions Act from the last year is probably the best known, I suppose. It requires you to inform a, a prospective buyers of a risk when selling them stocks or securities. A number of people suffered massive losses buying shares lately, so it was passed to keep people informed. Ah, so that's the history behind the Financial Transactions Act. There's an Imperial Transportation Act which determines the rules of the road for drivers. That was last year as well. And more and more people buying cars lately. No rules and commoners, but car accidents are getting out of hand. Especially true in Heimdall, which is why the law was enacted there first. There is a provisional taxation act, which was in practice just about every province you can think of. It was a fancy name for much reviled tax increases. Being enacted in the provinces almost doubling them than business taxes. You've probably at least heard of them. I have, yeah. We're going to start a question about recent law. It's probably going to be one of those three. 
Hopefully that'll be some help at least. Even if none will come up, you really help me out. I'm being a lot more confident now. Thanks both. I didn't do anything at all, I'm just hanging out. Is there anything else you want to know? Let me know, I'll be happy to help. Tell us where you good, uh, Student Council President. Well, my bond of Toe increased? I haven't got a bond link with her yet. Am I going to be fighting with Toe at some point? Excuse me. Who are you? You're a lovely maid. I do apologize for stopping you on a rainy day like this. Do you know if this is the building in which I might find the principal's office? Oh, yeah. You're in the right place. His office is in the East Wing, first floor. Oh, well, I wonder what's going on, Mentors. I was coming out of the uh, school building. The receptionist might have gone home already, but. <laughs> Thank you for your kindness. Made like a girl, so not made then. But I couldn't possibly trouble you more than I have already. I'll be able to find the way, I'm sure. Well then, if you'll excuse me, Master Reen. Who are you? Why do you know my name? I didn't introduce myself at all. Hmm. Wait a minute. How does she know? Reen? Ah, uh, hey there, Elisa. Heading back to the door. That's a very cute umbrella. Yep. Emma and the others are staying a little longer to cram a little more. But I figured I'm not going to learn much more today, so I might as well call it a night and start prepping for tomorrow. Right, right. Um, well, you're going my way, so what do you say we head back together? Sure, okay. Alyssa really distracted him from the obvious point there, but she knew his name. Hey, it's not often the two of us get to walk back to the dorms together, is it? <laughs> well... Uh, at least I got something good out of this downpour. That look. Is there even a filter between your brain and your mouth? <laughs> this is why Alyssa's the best girl, in my opinion. Right now. Opinion subject to change. Nah, no need for that between friends. But you're in good company. My sister's asked me that before, too. <sighs> She must be a saint to have put up with you all these years. <laughs> anyway, how do you feel? All prepped and ready for our exams? Not sure. I gave it the best I've got. Still, I've got that nagging feeling I could have hit the books a little harder. <laughs> I wish I was as smart as you. Back when we took the entrance exam, only Emma and Machia scored higher than you, right? Eustis came in a little higher than me, too. Back home, I usually came in near the top in exams. I guess that goes to show that Erebonia has no shortage of smart people. No doubt about that. Bookworms pour in here from all corners of the Empire. You said you're from Ruhr, right? Coming out on top in a city that size is still pretty impressive. I suppose, though that was just at the Sunday school level. Uh, aren't you curious about, you know, my family and stuff. We well, don't want to talk about it much because you just name yourself Alyssa R. But let's be honest, we all know her name. You mean the mysterious Alyssa R, agent of national intrigue? Well, yeah, of course I am. But you probably have good reasons for keeping it under wraps, so I don't want to pry. It's not that major or anything, especially compared to what you and Fee have told us about yourselves. I've never really thought my family circumstances were a big deal. No. These past sure came as a surprise. I wonder now, when I look at her, what her life in the Jaeger Corps must have been like. It seems like Instructor Sarah knows more about her past than we do. Back at the entrance ceremony, I got the impression they'd met before. Same. Oh, speaking of weird meetings, I ran into someone kind of strange earlier. Oh? Yeah, I was talking to her just before you called to me. A maid who knew your name? This isn't the part where it turns out she knows you because you've tried to hit on her in town before, is it? 
<laughs> as if an upstanding guy like me could pull off the Casanova act. She seemed a couple years older than us. Maybe 20 or so? A maid in her early... Hmm? No, no, just thinking. There's no way it could really have been her. Mother keeps her far too busy to find the time to come here. So yeah, Maybe it's a little maid. Maybe storm has a new hire starting out or something? Though that wouldn't explain how she knew your name. Maybe you're just more popular than you let on. <laughs> if only. Yep, yeah, Elisa is definitely your maid.